hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to guide how to fix the issue internet is not working wi-fi is not working on your windows 7 computer so as you can see here if i go to open and then click on change adopters so i don't have any driver of internet here even if i go to the device manager I don't have any driver on it so in my this computer the internet is not working so how to fix this issue I will show you okay so step number one will be just expand the network adapters here and if any disabled is here you need to right click on it right click on it and simply enable it so let me plug in the mouse into my computer So right click on it and simply enable it if it is disabled like this just right click on it and simply enable it and see if you are able to fix the issue or not if still not click on your computer name then click on action and click on action scan for hardware changes and see if any changes inside your network if i have just installed the windows on it so we have to install the driver if the wind uh, wi-fi was working fine and after some time it is not working then you can fix it just click on the computer host name then click on action add legacy hardware click on here next choose the second option then click on next and you need to press D on your keyboard and then M and click on modems then click on let me track it here then click on next and make sure it is untick then click on next and it will try to retrieve the drivers for your windows but in my case that is also not working So I need to check the services of the Wi-Fi or the Ethernet is working or not. Simply go to here, search their services, open them and once you open them, click anywhere on it and press W on your keyboard W and look for WLAN auto config. this one and make sure it is running it is already running okay this one now it has run successfully wlan auto config and wired automatic should be also enabled here both the services are running here but still the internet is not working And still driver is not listed here so in this case guys what you can do is you can connect with your phone and ethernet t3 you need to connect this cable into your computer with the usb port from one end let me remove it so this i have connected and from the other end you need to connect on your phone you need to connect like this one way from c type and another way from usb port okay then open your phone then go to the personal hotspots just tab it and just click on this option usb t3 this is the option now also you can see here one device is ready and it is trying spinning now it is attempting so as you can see here it is trying to retrieve the information and internet access is working here so let me show you now the 
edge since it has connected with the internet now you can see here we have also got the IP address let's select that and close it if I show you the internet is accessible here and now you can download the driver from google.com now internet should work on your windows guys this is and you can install the driver on your windows after that according to your laptop serial number or the system information just you need to select these numbers here and then connect with your internet and after that your issue will be fixed so this is the way to fix the issue guys so i hope uh, this video helps you if yes then help hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching